going to tell the viewers on YouTube too that um, uh, is it this Saturday that we celebrate the Kentucky Derby? Yeah. So all of you guys that are uh, planning to come to Kentucky, uh, come see the horses, but save a little bit of money so you can buy tools from Jesse. So, but uh, but yeah, uh, so they, they get to see it live on TV. And yeah. We tell people we've been here for like almost 20 years and we've never... I mean, I think we went down one time. I've been there several times. I've never actually watched the derby. I always go to the infield where the party's at. Yeah, it's yeah. like it gets so full of people that it's kind of like, uh, it, it gets packed. Yes. It, it gets packed. And then over the years, uh, like, like maybe, I don't know, 10, 17 years ago, it used to be nice because they didn't have like all the restrictions. And I know that we were able to take like a cooler with sodas, but ever since, um, I, I guess it was because of the, um, the terrorists, the 9-11, uh, then after that they put the extra security and now they don't let you walk in with anything. Really? You have to buy everything inside. Didn't know that. Mm -hmm. But many years ago people just used to take their cooler, a blanket, they would have yeah. their drinks, and then when that happened it was all over. So uh, we tell people that, you know, the good things, they just don't last. They, it's, it, you know, it, it's uh, um, uh, changes, everything, everything happens. And this is really cool, Jesse. You got two, two orange boxes. I've had that one on here for a little bit. It's a 1022 double bank. And then the other orange one in the box when I took it on trade. Mm -hmm. I just finally put it on a truck oh, and tried yeah. to run it. So you had a customer that uh, that traded for a new one? Yes, he got an Epic Series box, and we got him, and that's his trade in. That was nice. I I love how you fixed it, Jesse, with all the um, all the uh, sockets. These are the sale on the flyer. Yes. Mm -hmm. And if you guys notice too, Jesse also carries the. Uh, these are the. Uh, what are these called? It's not black. It's like a dark titanium. Dark titanium. And that's a fifty-six ounce, I think. Really. Mm -hmm. It's a big one. I got a couple more in. The, got the, a couple more things at home. Mm -hmm. For you know, a lot of guys work really hard all day, and they don't have time to clean their tools. So this would be something that's not going to show the grease and dirt so much. Yes. Mm -hmm. They can just but put it back. It's also in a dark color, so if your shop's dark, it is easy to lose. Mm -hmm. That's got some pros and cons. Uh huh. And you know, for whoever traded this box, this is really nice. Oh yeah. It's a it's a fantastic box. It's dusty. It came out of a body shop, but I mean the condition of it's really good. Mm hmm. This is something Mr. Mark would probably like. He likes the orange. Yeah, it's a beautiful box. I like how it's got the chrome, the chrome trim. So what's this yellow device here for, Jesse? Which one is the Oh, that's a power probe, piercing probe. So, so it's, you put that on the end of a power probe, and this actually pierces the wire to go through it to make connection. And there's another one floating around the truck somewhere. It just fell out. That's green. So these are like pieces for your power probe, mm -hmm. like the guys that actually have the uh yeah the gun the piercing pro okay or, that's pretty i cool. just put it up there so i wouldn't lose it i'll find another piece at some point and what are these that are in the little snap-on box uh i think that's a plastic pry tool oh i see those are um yeah they it's a little set that comes in a pouch yeah yeah those are nice yeah. How about the pizza oven, Roy? You see it? 
Mm, right behind Maria. Oh yeah, that is beautiful. Oh yeah, we saw that on the. We flyer. saw that on the That's flyer. So nice. So and and I told the guys from all the items that we showed on the flyer, I said, you know, these are gonna be, I, these are items that they have to like purchase something to get it. Yep. I went up doing the one twine drawing and buy certain things so I can put you in on it. And then if you guys notice, there's the first customer that put his name already. Yep. Yeah. This would be so awesome, like a, like on some of your houses you have like where the stainless grill is. This would be cool to have out there in your um, in the back dock of your home. For... Well, that one actually runs off propane too, so if you had a spot next to your grill, it would be perfect. Uh-huh. Yeah, because some people like to, especially like in Chicago, I used to go up there. We had friends and uh, that, that lived in Chicago, and they had their, um, it, it, you know, like the Italians, they had the little brick it, mm -hmm. where the grill is, and they would do their own pizza. It was pretty cool. And, and this one here, I was showing the guys from yeah, the... from the scooch this way because I want you in the mirror. From, uh, fr from, the, uh, from the flyer yesterday, Jesse, I was showing them this, that this is what divides, that makes the slices. And then if you guys notice, it's got the little uh, snap-on stamped on it. Yep. It's nice. So uh, I'm thinking that this has like a handle. Hi. Uh, one of them does. There's two pieces here, and I put one over in the toolbox. I kept this one because it's got the stamp on logo stamped on it. But one of them has a little block handle that goes to it, and then it actually has the cutting boards with it. I didn't take stuff out of the boxes because, well, if you buy something from me, I mean, I don't think you want everybody's fingerprints on your cutting board. Uh, on the cutting board. board. And that's kind of why I left that wrapped in plastic. Mm-hmm. But this is, yeah, I like how they stamp mm -hmm. that, uh, and then this looks expensive too, Jesse, the Camp Chef. Yeah, it's actually pretty heavy. I was kind of surprised by the, the size, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's different, and I'm actually glad it seems like it's pretty good quality. Mm-hmm. And, uh, it's got, like, these little vents on the side, I guess, for the heat to... Yeah, very interesting. It almost looks part of like your grill. So, um, but yeah, that was, uh, and then um, I noticed that on the flyer, they had like the big umbrella that hooks up to your truck hitch. <laughs> yes. So, so I told them that, um, um, and that we were gonna ask you today too, these are like, you as a, as a seller, you get certain packages? Yes, I buy packages for the tools and that's one of the prizes for it. And they do it in series, so like so many tools will come out where if you buy a tool with this pack, I can give you a chance to win the pizza oven. Or if you buy certain things, I can actually give you a pizza oven with it. I got a couple multiple ones. And then next, I think, is uh, Dixon Summertime shirts and gnomes are coming. The trailer hitch, and there's actually a retro cooler that's... I think it's supposed to be all metal. It looks really cool in the flyer, but I haven't seen it yet, so I don't know how it looks in person. Okay. Hopefully it's nice. I, I, I didn't know it was called a gnome, because I, I yesterday when I was doing that, I, I called the little guy the gnome man. I don't <laughs> even know what gnome man is, so it's, <laughs> it, it's supposed to be the gnome. But, um, yeah, like, I, I was telling my wife, Jesse, if you ever get into the, um, like, the Coca-Cola cooler, uh, the Snap-on cooler, that's something. That, yeah. Because it's got a thing where you can open your Coke bottles. I think that one has on the outside of it. Mm-hmm. And I'm guessing, knowing Snap-on, they do really nice stuff. I'm guessing that they're going to have, like, the painted metal around the cooler, so it'll be something like this. Josh actually gave my mom a retro snap-on cooler for Christmas this year. Mm -hmm. It's on like wheels, it's metal, it's got two opening doors, a Coke yeah. bottle opener. Yeah, those are really hot because uh, anything that's Coca-Cola, I even have a customer gave me one of those old-fashioned, um, it, it's, it's a sign like this, but it's made out of like the sign you gave us, mm -hmm. the 100 metal. metal. Yeah. Uh -huh. And it's got the Coca-Cola with, you know how Snap-on, 
uh, from the 1940s up mm -hmm. until now, they had the different name. Yep. Uh, that's how that Coca-Cola had the different. Well, this one's actually a metal snap-on one. It looks like the Coca-Cola ones. It's mm -hmm. got a stand with it. The, yes. And it's, I know my mom really liked it. Josh got it for us. He got it for it. It wasn't me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So, um, yeah, those, those make nice, nice gifts and, and people like them. And um, besides this, Jesse, for the viewers, um, do you have any tools that might be new or that people may uh, need? This week on promo, I got... Because I kind of ran to the back and I didn't check anything that you um, had in the front. I got these... Those are blue, nice. Blue Point AP10s are adjustable. So the little device here, Jesse, what is this for? That releases it, Roy. So look, whenever you push it in, it lets you slide all the oh. way down. But like if you got a boat you can't find or or that's in a weird place, hard to get the size on, just put it right there. Then go up until it grabs. Oh, interesting. And then loosen it and do it like that. It just makes it easier to adjust, kind of one hand. And these are, you have them in both sizes? Yeah. That looks like a smaller or version. AP10s and AP7s. And you sell those as a set or individually? Individual, Roy. Okay. I got some 44 did ACFs. You, did you see that? Really? I thought they were really neat. Nice little pocket tool. Something you can put them with you that helps you. Mm -hmm. I got, let's see. 12 piece snap ring plier set. See, we were on promo this month. I got a bunch of different colors red, blue, dark titanium. I think I got green coming in. But it's one in a nice case with a foam insert. And the foam on this one, it's not colored. I thought it was blue. Mm -hmm. Those are pretty cool looking too in the blue. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Shepherd's Fleet would like those. Uh, he's a gentleman that has a company in Ohio. He watches our channel. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, let's he, see. He works on the big rigs. That's interesting, too, the custom grill basket set. Yeah, this is in our promo where if you buy the snap ring cars, I can give you this. So, look, Vijita, it's got the different, like, oh, uh, gr the, the different grilling utensils, see? Nice. There's a picture of them being used up there. So for corn on the cob, burgers, all kinds of kebabs, hot dogs. Yeah, and it even comes with the little stickies that go on your um, the end of the corn. The end of the corn. Mm -hmm. That is cool. And over here, got convertible snap ring pliers. I haven't opened that set yet. So Jesse bought a couple of uh, of the um, of the packages. Yep. And on this one, I trying to see what other colors I had. I got red, high vis, dark titanium, black, blue. I still do have some more blue. Those are pretty cool, Vijita. Look, he's got different uh, ratchets with yeah. the uh, with the different colors with the hard handles. One's flex head and one's solid. Just whichever one you like, but. The hard handles, they've been going over pretty well lately. That's the first time I see that one because i only seen them like that, mm -hmm. but that's the first time in the flex. And then these kits, you get a quarter-inch drive and the three-eighths. So that's pretty nice, and that's one of the things I'm doing giveaways with. Uh, and I think those are new too, Jesse. I had never seen those. All of the grilling gloves? Look, they look thick. So yeah, these are these are different, I guess. So you don't see, and it's got the little grip with the snap on, so you don't. So Jesse, you sell these separately, or they have to go no, with? No, the... they're going with the tool package. With... I only got two of them, so I really can't split them up. Mm -hmm. But if you guys notice, if you buy that tool package, it's got the. Um, they almost look like impact gloves. Yeah. Yeah, these are cool. They're thick. And they're nice. Yeah, those, uh, they, uh, they have this color that just pops out. And you still have promos on the socket sets, too. Oh, yeah. These are new, the uh, latex gloves. Yeah, the Glove Works ones. They came, ah, uh, crap, I started carrying those about a month ago, and they went over really well. 
Viejita. And Jesse also has these. These were on the flyer. So, yeah. so this is a. Uh, it's inline water house. Oh, also. look, and it's got the. It's almost about the size of your. Um, what do you call your polisher? There. Oh. Uh, a grinder. The, your grinder, yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. We do have one of the new brushless grinders. Can't even open this one yet. That's the first time I get to see one of those Vijita because they're new. Yeah. And it's a little bit different than our old model. So the when you started the button would be here. Oh, I don't really know how this works, Roy. I think this would be the lock for the head. Mm -hmm. So when you want to change bits, yep, that's your head lock. Your speed controls down there, variable. And then your power switch. Mm -hmm. Say I don't know if I got a charge battery up front. Got one back here. I think those batteries, when they come in the box from the factory, I think they have a, a little bit of charge. Yeah. And this is a new brushless one, so let's see if we. Oh, cool. And if you know, if you if you low. hear it too, it's not like super loud. It's it's kind of quiet. Well, the hot side's definitely a little more aggressive, but I like it more. Yeah, I was thinking that would be cool to put like a little polishing and then use that to polish the like the rims on the truck. Yeah, <laughs> you get some tight places with it, especially being long and angled. Mm -hmm. well, yeah. That's new, and I've never had one of these on a truck before. Now everybody's asking or wanting to go to the brushless. I like the brushless stuff. It seems like it's got a lot more power. More power. Uh -huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So folks, thank you for watching. You got to see some of the new toys that Jesse showed us today. And then, you know, you can write your name to apply for the pizza, the pizza uh, oven. And then he also has this one right here. Um, what is this called, Jesse? The, it's a grill basket set. The grill basket set. And uh, we would like to thank Jesse for letting us film on the truck today. And uh, thank you for watching. And we'll see you guys next Monday. Thank you. Bye.